What is going on guys? Aaron with Lansing Lawn Service. Today I'm showing you my 2018 snow removal setup. Thank you for watching this video today. Please hit that subscribe button and join the lawn crew. Also make sure that you show that like button some love. Be sure to check out our lawn care wear shop on Teespring. The link is in the description below. You guys are going to love the shirts there. If you enjoy this video, please leave a comment down below. Now let's get back to the video. All right, guys, so right here, first things first, we have the Ram 1500 Outdoorsman Series. It's got the 5.7 liter Hemi. It's a heavy duty truck for a 1500. Now they don't make the Outdoorsman series anymore. This is a 2011. I think I already said that. Woo, guys, it is cold out here. As far as the snow plow goes, we have the Snow X 8000 RH plow. It's a straight blade plow. This is your mid grade plow for your 1500 trucks, things like that. This is an eight foot plow. They also make a seven foot six plow and it has a steel edge. It's not the poly blade. It's got the easy attach system and it's all hydraulic. It's not train, chain driven. Now I have plowed with this plow once so far this year. I've done 12 accounts with it, just residential accounts and it works pretty good. It is light. It's about 450 pounds or so, so it is light. Uh, doesn't back drag the best, but it works. For this plow, I did have to put a three and a half inch leveling kit on the front of the truck, and that has done wonders for getting the plow up high enough for transport. Now, I will say, um, if you're gonna plow with a 1500, you really need to do your research. Make sure that you're going with a light enough blade. Don't go with, you know, something that's made for a 2500 truck. Uh, it's just going to be too heavy. Now, on to my other stuff here. I've got just the regular lights on here. These are not LED lights. It matches good with the truck. And I really like that. All right, now let's move on to the other stuff. The next uh, piece of equipment that I am using this year for snow removal is my Toro Powerlight 98cc engine, 16 inch width. It's paddles, but it throws the snow very well. And this little machine compared to the two stage snow thrower that I had a couple years back, is night and day. I would always recommend if you're doing commercial snow removal to go with a paddle driven snow blower because in especially light snow these things will blow a two-stage snow thrower out of the water. Guys these things are much faster and they do a fantastic job. Now on to what I'm using for salt. I purchased this Groundworks Pro Series spreader at my local tractor supply store and I purchased it for 80 bucks, around 80 bucks, 79, 80 bucks um, for seed originally and this now I'm using it for salt. So it does a good job and I don't have a lot of salting to do, so I'm certainly not going to go out and buy a three or four hundred dollar spreader to put down three or four bags of salt a season. So that is why I'm choosing to use this instead of something more expensive. It does the job. Yes, it has some metal parts on it, which can corrode with the salt, but it's 79 bucks, so I don't really care all that much. I will do maintenance on it, try to keep it in the best shape I can, but all in all, 
I can just go get another one if I need one. And the last thing of my snow removal setup for 2018 is my light. This is an X-Bright Amber light and it does very well at night. Not so much in the day as you can see. I mean the camera doesn't show how bright it is very well but it is good and it costs me 35 to 45 dollars i think i got it on sale on amazon and it had really good reviews so i went with it i don't need a hundred two hundred dollar light bar it's magnetic it sticks to the top of my truck it's good enough it's got an on off switch it has different modes you can select so that's all i needed whoa guys it is cold out here with wind chill it's got to be 20 degrees i'm starting to freeze but guys that is my 2018 snow removal setup thank you guys for watching make sure that you like comment subscribe and as always we will see you in the next one